So I, I looked back at the old sketches and, and there was just lots of different designs in there. Um, I was sitting in my mother's living room looking around and um, uh, she has a collection of Japanese fans. And uh, the more I thought about it, I thought, wow, this is a really, really great shape because it not only relates to the culture, but it's geometrically a very interesting shape and uh, a pattern. You see these pipes here? There's actually a scupper along the back edge and all the water comes this way and then goes down through these pipes so it doesn't drip off the front edge. It, it kind of looks like a kind of elongated butterfly or something like that, but to tell you the truth, it was just a, a chance to do something abstract. They're asymmetrical, left doesn't match right. They're a little bit different sizes. You know, they're six feet tall. And the other thing is when the doors were built, you know, we had to make sure that it fit the mullion or the spacing on the door. And I don't know how many times these get pulled, but thousands of times. So I got to design the hardware and make sure it stayed strong and fit and uh, was soft to the touch. Um, I knew that a lot of people would be coming and touching it. So I wanted to make something more sensual, soft, uh, inviting. Both uh, pieces were a challenge because they're not something I typically do, you know, canopies and door pulls. You know, I basically do sculptures and fountains.